Hello everybody, welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus with me, Flick. Also my Twitch audience, because we are recording, just got started with the stream, we're recording this on Christmas Eve, actually, although you'll be seeing it after the fact. And I might as well do a Patreon shout-out, because I still have a few of those to do while I'm still recording for November. So, uh, thank you, Garlock Thornbow. You may or may not turn up tonight, but this one is for you. And we're going to do Eden. I know I said I'd do greedier modes on stream, but I don't want to do that right now, because... I don't want to get annoyed at the game on Christmas Eve. I'd much rather, what is this fabulous hairstyle with this makeup? So if you want to play along, X7XT B7DJ is the seed. Book of Sin is good. The charm makeup or whatever it's called, I don't think is that great. Our stats seem pretty terrible. Oh good, our fire rate is bad. So is our speed. Hmm, okay, it's one of those runs. This is, yeah, I literally just started Valinor. And this is how the run's gonna go. Oh. I was, I honestly had prepared myself for that to be a, uh, well, a health down. I wonder if, you know how RNG isn't actually true random, if you're a nerd, as in like, you know, the, the RNG that games use are not random because they are within a certain parameter or more than one parameter. I wonder if Isaac, has certain parameters that change based on either the time of day or the month because it feels like every run I've had in December where stats can be randomized have had bad tier rates. Maybe not literally every time but more often than not. And look at this tier rate. We're getting very lucky with all this miscellaneous stuff though. Hanged man. I'd rather... I'd rather... Blind Rage, Blind to Damage. Don't know what that does. I think I'd rather use the bomb on the guaranteed results here. Although if I get another one, I'll try and remember and go back. Why wouldn't they be random? Because it's not true random, because there's criteria by which they are limited. For instance... Oh. Eden has rules where he is not allowed to have below certain amounts on stats if he has certain amounts on other stats. I I walked over that knowing that it would hurt me as well. Give me a spirit heart to... No, never mind. Thank you, Havel, POV26, for the bits. Oh, I forgot to remind everybody. I believe Twitch is still doing the hashtag charity thing again. I'm not sure when it runs out. So if you were planning on giving bits, include hashtag charity and you will make Twitch give a little bit of money to a uh, disaster relief fund. That's my bad, I keep forgetting to mention it. This is not, I keep checking, thinking it's a double floor because it's, it feels like a long floor, but that's largely because of the tier rate being bad. Uh, yeah, don't worry about it. I forgot to mention it. I've been forgetting to mention it. Despite there being a few people who often give, like, farmed bits right at the start of a stream and I keep forgetting. Could you please stop regenerating? Because I can't get to you because you keep on spawning enemies every time you die. How am I supposed to kill him? Just, I, I can't kill him because I keep on getting pushed away from him. Uh huh. I, I can't. The tier rate is too bad to get the shots in required to kill him. Oh, he eventually commits suicide if you if he lives too long. No, wait, no, he recovered from that too. I I can't win this room. <laughs> Maybe using the hangman will let me float over the scenery at him. I guess. Okay, that was a literally unwinnable room. I'm just going to hold until we get a basement. There we go, that'll do. NKBG FNRR. What a terrible, terrible setup. Don't make enemies that are literally unkillable if your tier rate is above 10. It's dumb. That's also dumb. Let's hold for a better result than that. Hello, Elsa here. Yeah, it's been a while since I've had this, but I've only got one heart. That's not good enough. That's too good. Oh, I just accidentally shrunk the game as well. <laughs> As for good, not amazing. Eh, tier rate's bad. Fantastic mustache, though. Eh, this looks okay. 
I could just keep the verp thing going forever. Yep, that, that lets you do that forever. Okay, so 2D7WCCQJ is actually the seed we're going with. Look, if I'd taken Mom's knife, I would have won with ease and I would have had nothing to talk about. It's not worth playing, basically. This has a good tier rate. It has below average damage, but I'm willing to accept that because the tier rate is good. So if I was to get that room again, it would actually be solvable. And we have good HP. I'm not using the prayer card yet because I might as well just wait. Unless we get a battery. Easiest way to do this room is just run. Hillscar Rebel, my day was very boring because again I'm still a little ill so I haven't done anything. Mostly just sat around resting. Feeling better though. Like I didn't feel the need to take any paracetamol today, put it that way. Although I might end up regretting that by the end of the stream, we'll see. Might take some during the break actually. It's just because I feel a little bit better doesn't mean I should stop taking medicine I suppose until I'm well over it. Get out the way. Battery? No. Demon baby is okay. Oh, thank you. Demon baby plus one HP. So this might have the makings of a red heart run, which I've not done for quite some time. Yeah, the shoving guys are very annoying. A very poor addition, <laughs> but so is everything they added, basically. So you just expect it. That is a very short floor. Hello, G Rave. Hello, Monstro. I don't have anyone in my chat called Monstro. I'm just being polite and saying hello to the boss. Because it feels like Monstro is an old friend, given that he's existed since the first version of Isaac. Hit me all you want. It's the first floor. Nobody cares. Now, thin rooms, on the other hand, should never be a thing. They're a bad addition as well. But what can you do? Goodbye. Tears up. Excellent. Getting everything I wanted now. Oh, I forgot to say at the start of the stream, but again, I should be starting streaming tomorrow around about midday. I think I should be getting back here about 11 and I want to quickly like have something for an early lunch and then I should be good to go. And I'll be starting a new file on Bioshock Infinite, which I think I only ever played through fully once. I liked it, but I did only play it through once. Piercing Shot is very good. The speed up is kind of nice as well. Not having a spirit heart on this floor is bad. Also, you like my goat legs? They just look like I'm wearing fashionable trousers, honestly. Hello, scientist. I'm Padawan. I installed Afterbirth Plus to have other things to unlock. I'm very well aware I could just uninstall it. Although that doesn't remove the patching they did, which made the game worse as well. Although apparently, out of nowhere, the anti-birth guy posted a, an update almost a year later saying that they're working on an update to it. I didn't actually go confirm that the comment I got on that was mm. right. Mm. Uh, fight the boss, try for the devil. Mm. Mm. Oh. I will read that after Little Horn is dead. Bear with me. What is that hole? It's not going away. Do you see that hole on the left there? It's a half hole. It only vanished just there. Good item and a good deal with the devil. Thank you, Havel, for the bits and for remembering hashtag charity. They're up to 54,000.7 raised. 
direct relief, sorry, not disaster relief. Although I think that is still what that's for, right? His bright idea was it both to make Krampus be able to fire diagonally sometimes and also move his beams with no tell for it either. Had the item room. I will go to the curse room. Might as well have a look over here too actually, because it's a basement floor, it's easy. I suppose it is fitting that we got Krampus though, given the time of year. Half a black car. Um, I'll check that last room again because it's a basement floor. It shouldn't be anything too problematic. Good old basements. And we don't need the shop because we don't have enough for anything. But we will get plus one HP again. Hello, Andres. That was a very small spider. The little monstro faces, as far as additions go, I don't have a problem with them, but I don't know if they were added in the community mod or if that's a patch thing. I mean, the community mods are a patch thing as well, but they are 99% not thought up by the developers, which is why they're good, usually. Well, since we found the boss, we might as well just go for it. Gertie Jr. Very liable to get hit. But we didn't. No deal with the devil. But we've got more... That's us at the tier cap. Probably safe to do that now. We're actually holding the dolly. I often don't see that because when I get the item I've got too many other things that overwrite it. As a visual effect, that is. Are there any targets this run? Nope. I'm trying to think if there's any like weird ones. I, I guess there's items I haven't picked up that I have unlocked that you need to pick up to work towards 1001%. So technically, there's that. They'd mostly be in the Angel deals, I think. So maybe it's good that we got Krampus, I guess, because it's a 50-50 chance at an Angel deal now. And if we're running Red Hearts, then yeah. <laughs> Can maybe make the Angel deals work for once. Is it double floor? No. I just haven't found item room. Gimpy or Monstro's Tooth? Well, there's an obvious choice. Also, Clutch Magic Mush, clearly. Lemon party. I'll take another Lemon Party now that I know where it is. Ooh. Ooh. Thank you, Green31. Oos! For the very generous bits and for remembering hashtag charity. Merry Christmas Eve, everyone. Hashtag charity. Because nothing says Christmas Eve like matricide. That's the one where you're killing your mother, right? I don't want a half price ladder. I do want a full price PhD, though. Speed up, very nice. If I use this here, we can't get into the secret room until we get another bomb, but it was worth it. Well, I could buy the half price ladder now, actually. Sure. Hello, 
Hello Lord Demosy, you're waiting for your flight. Are you going home to see the family or similar? Although travelling on Christmas Eve, that's a hell of a thing. We have done everything. Actually, can I guarantee deals with Angel more by playing the sacrifice room? Well, it takes spare hearts though, doesn't it? Yeah. Because eventually it will tell me I, I feel blessed. And I've already done this floor. Yeah, let's play this a little bit more, just to see what happens. You feel blessed. There we go. Now we have a 100% chance to deal with Angel. But does that apply to every floor or just this floor? And now I want to take this for protection. Yeah, let's give that a go and see what happens. Then we go. It's a flooded caves. No, it was just for that floor. Okay, well, if there's a sacrifice room on this floor and I have a few spirit hearts, I can try again. At least we have a map. We do not need that because we have PhD. Bugger. Okay, so we're down to half a spirit heart in terms of protection. Oh, I see a question about the steam sales. Oh, so they left their Christmas sale a bit late this year, didn't they? You're looking through the Steam sales, Civ 5 plus a bunch of DLC is available for 11.26. Whether that's pounds or dollars, that sounds like a good deal to me. Broken modem, the box, the moving box or whatever I think. No spirit heart, which is what I was after. Civilization 5 is a very good game, I would say, personally. I am a nerd, however, so I'll take everything I say with a grain of salt. Even baby, I need to not have you fire when they're right next to me, please. It's a little hard to dodge as I let that hit me. Oof, you died super fast though. We didn't get any deal at all at a 67.5% chance, which is really bad. And that is below average. We still need item room. Don't want to make a mistake like I did on the, the first Maggie Delirium attempt where because I got a secret room item, I forgot that I hadn't been to the item room for the floor. You know how rare it is to get an item out of your secret room, so when I saw that I had an extra item, I was just like, yeah, that's what I got in the item room. It wasn't. It wasn't at all. Probably shouldn't have used the prayer card since I wasn't done on the floor yet, but as I say, I had forgotten I hadn't been to the item room yet. Yeah, that was an acceptable number of shots. Burn them all! Is anyone else in the same position as me where, because it's Christmas, like, streamers and YouTubers you watch aren't uploading as much? I was, I was finding a, a deficit of content to watch today, which was also not helping my boredom. Because you don't really want to do anything when you're ill, but at the same time, I need something for background noise. Can try for some black hearts here, maybe. Although, the sacrifice room again would have been able to give us a 100% chance angel deal. Oh well. You're going to buy Civilization 5 BRB? Ah, uh, no, we'll see you in a few months, probably, if you get very into it. Mom's bra is very bad. Oh, was that a tinted rock? No. Never mind then. But we could play the Sacrifice Room a few times. We don't have any Spirit Hearts right now. One heart, two heart, go three hearts and then go heal. Yeah, that gave me a 100% chance to deal with Angel again. I thought it paid out like other stuff if you played it enough. That's one heart back. Two heart back. I, th like, I thought one of the payouts was like a crap ton of Spirit Hearts. 
Which is kind of what I'm gunning for here. One. Two. Oh! Okay, that works. Um, I don't need Mega Satan on Eden, do I? No. No real point fighting the angel then. Okay, we've got the sky pillar out of it. That wasn't too bad. Where uh, Was I aware that the Cybertron games are no longer available on Steam? I thought the first one wasn't, but the second one that I started playing on stream is. The fact that it's a broken piece of crap might have something to do with it. I'm not sure. I, mean, I don't think I'll be going back to on stream just because it crashes every time I play it in one way or another. The console version was good though. No problems with that at all. What is a Yule Log? That's the thing that's like... Um, sugared... Sugar... What is it actually? What is its key ingredient? It's got sugar on top and it's got raisins and crap in it. Uh, sponge? Rolled sponge, I think? A good... A damn good cake. I disagree. It's very similar to wedding cake to me, which is also why I don't like it. Okay, well, Steven's fine. Um, might as well get a natural charge and then use that just to give ourselves yet another red heart that we'll never trade away because we're not getting deals with the devil. Oh, there's a sacrifice room again. But that's the, the thing with the sacrifice rooms. I've got to have enough spirit hearts to play it to get the blessed. But then at the same time not use red hearts because otherwise my chance to get a deal at all drops down to 33 and a third percent. You beat Orphan of course. Well done. I hate that boss. Thank you for helping curve my bullets there. That made that very easy. Piercing shot. That's true. Potato peeler. I could make a meat boy army. Although, actually, if I get hit, like, more than a couple of times, I mean, and my percentage chance drops down anyway, then I might as well find a sacrifice room and play it some more. This is not Mom, so let's just go for it, see if what deal we get. It's a 100% chance to get a deal, but it's a 50-50 on whether it's an Angel deal. Unless I get hit three times. And I don't think I should. Angel deal, angel deal, angel deal. It's not an angel deal, it's a devil deal. But it all sets up though. Clutch magic mush. I mean, if I ignore this deal, then we'll go on the angel path again. Whatever, let's try. Uh, I should find a shop. I'm not really caring about boss rush. Yule logs are chocolate sponge and cream chocolate filled covered in chocolate shell covered in chocolate icing that's too much chocolate I can barely envision the thing you've just described but what I can take from your description is that's too much chocolate don't tell court they exist it's all you eat I'm gonna need you to there we go great no great well, just to maintain that extra chance of an next floor, we're going to lift that and nothing else. Got to remember it's mom next floor, though. Item room, shop, curse room, we're ignoring. Good to go. Mix it with some salted caramel cream as well. You're going too far!
Yeah, we won't see you for a while, g -Riff. You'll be playing Civ 5 forever. The only advice I can give is don't trust Gandhi. Because he'll kill you. Go on heading to the right. Made some salted popcorn. I don't mind salted popcorn every now and then. I do prefer sweet, I'll be honest, but I don't mind salted. I also don't mind when they're mixed together. As long as the mix is a fair mix and not... Ooh, lots of money. And not like, here's 90% salted and 5% and five sweet. No, 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 piercing shots won't let me. Oh, thank you for that, though. Of course we found the one boss fight instantly when I don't want to. Poke your head up. Poke your friggin' head up. It's Christmas, you bitch! <laughs> Finally. Another... Wait, was that dime again or was that nickel? It looks silver to me. Oh hey, some of you are from countries where you open all your presents on Christmas Eve, not Christmas, right? So what did you get? Also, you're breaking the rules. <laughs> Screw you two. Ah, something's wrong. Still need item room and our last shop was a bust and I couldn't even donate on a run where I got a bunch of money. Poland has that tradition, for example. Well, oh, well, tell me what you got then. Hmm. No, I, I like the conquest fly we've got. Zeppel got a coffee maker. It's a strange thing to get when tea is the only acceptable beverage. Warm beverage. Oh. And, oh, Gimpy paid out. I knew that thing was in the air, but I couldn't tell if it had come up high enough because it was actually in the screen below. As in, like, the lower half of it. And more skeletons? Oh, god damn it. Yeah, okay. Game breaking bug. It does weird stuff when it touches things. I guess fight mom and see if we get an angel deal. One in three chance of a deal and then a 50-50 chance of it being an angel deal. Zippo's making some revenge coffee. Make it and then throw it down the toilet. Which is the only place it belongs. Yeah. Oh, you bitch, you always get me with the eye. No deal. Might as well just go full red heart, I guess. There we go. Hello, Stealth Sale. Can't resist plastic crack. Very true. Although Monsanto is a pretty good cure for it in the interim. How did that miss me? Oh well, never mind. Gimpy, I'm afraid you're no longer of any use to me because we're running full Red Heart build and we're not going to get any deals with the devil. It's one of those rare runs where little Chad is more worthwhile than you are, and that's scary. I'd like to get off this floor as soon as possible, just because it's a dark one. 
Hey, this room got slowed down. Puberty. Puberty. I remember saying the exact same thing when I had puberty. 10,000 years ago. Um. Their chance is low regardless, so. What is that? That is not Judas' shadow. It looks different. Shade it follows. Oh, yeah, it does, doesn't it? So it's like multi dimensional baby, it's following my movements every few seconds. I not do anything if I shoot through it though. So I've never picked that up before, so we have actually achieved something because that's now going to be on my item list. Because it's not good enough just to unlock an item, you have to have picked everything up at least once. I think I unlocked this recently as well, maybe for doing Delirium as Judas. He seems to have a lot of shadow related stuff. By which I mean one thing. Ah, uh, yeah, why not? I was so sure that may have been a, a Joker card, I was like, that's our ticket right there. But no, it's just a way to double up our money. It was easy enough. A lot of hearts to come back to if I need them, which I hopefully shouldn't. <sighs> Wrong way for the boss though. See the thing is, I, I triggered my special power by saying I'd like to get off this floor quickly because it's a dark floor. Instantly in that second, my quirk if you will, activated and now we'll find every dead end. That's right, you're getting all the up to date My Hero Academia memes, or references, not memes rather. Now that I actually understand them. Joker card? Joker card. Ah, okay. Those are bombs. It's also very unlikely we'll make any use of having the Polaroid. Oh well, we need it to get to the chest, but other than that. had to touch me and now we've got a 0.5% not even a 1% what the hell but oh, we have full HP so I might as well take the pony because <laughs> we don't need it for anything else we're not getting a deal with the devil unless we're about to get a run reroll nope we're just gonna get a lot of poop oh look because I can fly the it follows has got wings Quite well. Ow. I saw a reference of Whoville and it distracted me. I, for one, side with the Grinch prior to the meddling whatchamacallums. Midgets, that's the word. I have a feeling this is the right way. It still could be the right way. Uh, that ghost one crossed over the vaginal blood river it still could be the right way come on god damn it 
Ah! Tears up, if only. We're at the camp, unfortunately, unless we get an item that breaks the camp. Well, one dead end is fine. I won't find another one on this floor, anyway. For some reason, that one in particular seemed very tanky. GB Bug does do something. It has to touch enemies, though. Friggin' effing f f f f f f f f grumble grumble. How does one turn a quirk off? Ah! I can't turn it off. It's a blessing and a curse. Actually, it's probably just a curse. He was. He was. It has to be down here. Yeah, it set that fly on fire, for instance. I don't have anything else that could have done that. Puberty. I found the boss. Isaac! Newton! Is that you? Newton. It's like Marco Polo except weirder. Personally because of the pony plus magic mush I can't see the bullets I was dodging so not surprised I got hit. Uh, we opened up the way to Delirium and to Hush but no deal with the devil. I don't think I can actually go into Hush without triggering the delirium teleport, so let's just go. I don't think I could have got in the hush door. I think the portal would have pulled me in. That's fine, if the delirium portal opens up on the chest after Blue Baby, I'll go to it then. Just I want to get some more items. Sure, health up, why not? So I think you're right. Flight plus holy death. That was a dead end, yes. Let's not dwell on it. Oof, that one was getting uh, stuck on the top wall there by its friend. Not the... Uh, oh, right, good. It's not the envy room. Gotta watch out for the mom hands, which I don't think... Yeah, they fall at normal speed, even if the room is slowed. They have the appearance of being slowed, but they are not slowed. Not 100% sure I killed that last one. I think I... Yeah, it must be. Alright, the battery is good. Let's check the curse room just because it's got Guppy's tail in it. That means we're going to get more chests on the chest. So it is actually a good, a good thing that we got it here. Not that we're going to become Guppy because that's basically impossible. Might be literally impossible unless I get Chaos and I don't even think you can get Chaos outside of the shops. Gonna need you to like die, great. Thanks. That was pretty cool. Oh good, two steam cells. Back to back steam cells. Now all I need is a dead end. Hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> Hmm. 
Never mind. Nobody knows the total monster roster for World. I would hazard a guess that the box coming with at most 40. I don't think it's going to be very high, but they will be adding more. 40, 50? It's nowhere near going to be the 100 odd that was in Generation slash Cross. In my opinion, obviously I don't have a source, but that is my inkling, it's not going to be that many. I'm saving the spacebar for a second form, in case you're curious. Uh, long after his death beam finished its animation, I was hit by his death beam. Isaac's doing a good job avoiding GB Bug. Hmm. Mm. Mm. Thank you, I will read that. Mm. No memento. Ooh. Thank you, Skull Rebel, for the bits and for remembering to do hashtag charity. Good luck with your dead end curse. It is a thing that I... it is my burden and my curse. Oh hey, you gave Valinar the mutilated gingerbread person, which is the best kind of gingerbread person. Oh, how badly do I want to wreck this run, or I could just fight Mega Saiyan. I don't want to break the run because our tier rate is already really good. I don't care about fighting Mega Saiyan, so I think I'd like to try for four more items. First, though, maybe see what pills we can get. We got a transformation. Can I uh, just? Yeah, we're gonna say goodbye to flying. Okay, this is better. It's a shame we've run out of keys. How many puberties must I go through? I don't know quite what the straw does. It, it does AoE damage, right? I've just got to charge it. I think that's what it's doing. No. Don't need chocolate milk. Thank you, though. Oh, hey, Grade, you're going to give me my third Steam sale or, or what? Because I like items being even less than free. I like a good deal. I am Scottish. Nope, never mind. That is an item in there, though. Friends on fly, sure. That is not going to be a path. Nope. Is the benefit over Tammy's head that the straw doesn't require line of sight, but it probably does less damage, or doesn't synergize with your tear effects? That seems to be what it is. Oh, chemical peel's fine. I would hope that three steam cells would make them pay me to take the items, but sadly I doubt it. Here, take this ladder for plus seven pennies. Gonna kill our tier, right? But I thought it'd look cool. I need I need more keys. That is way too much foreign singing, g -Rave. In general, there's too much singing in my chat, but very specifically, singing I don't understand. I 
afraid I can only allow you all to sing songs in Klingon. Telepills? Did anyone lose a wrath? I found a room full of wrath. It's a shame because we're going to be getting a lot of chests thanks to Guppy's Tail and we can't take advantage of them because I didn't hoard keys early enough. So really we have no reason to full clear the floor. That was probably not a smart pickup. Just looking for our blue baby and to be done with it. Give me keys! The Evil Vice President did one there that I apparently have to allow because I guess something you said sounded like a bad word in English. Let's uh, bring this back to English chat. I don't want random people coming in thinking, oh, this is a Polish stream. Metronome? Eh. For the record, I don't know what the metronome does in this. It's really good in Gungeon. enough HP. <laughs> Unless I keep on blowing myself up, of course. Although we're getting a lot of flies from something. Well, the portal didn't open anyway, so we'll catch that one in. Alright, let's do... we'll just keep running here for the local recording as well. We'll just go straight into another Eden run. And see what we get. Cappy's paw would be nice. The moving box and steam sail. Terrible tier rate though. Okay, let's just hold our nuts, never mind. F fabulous hair! Or is that a hat? Oh, it's a hat. It's like a cat hat, never mind. But, Dad's Key plus Guppy's Hairball is interesting. Tear rate is still fairly bad and so is damage. Ah, it's interesting items though. Okay, we'll give this one a go. 1Z9N 9J93. And hopefully we'll just get something that improves our basic stats. Eh. Well, the, the D... whatever it is, re-roll your items would be nice, but I like the items this has started us with. Yeah, it does kind of look like that emote. Well, hello, all the things. The hairball is no use to us, really, outside of being progressed towards Guppy. It's very hard to hit if you don't have temporary invincibility of any kind. At least at first. Once it gets big, then it's not nearly as bad. 
But it's just it's too hard to steer to bother with. You know, we started this run with cat ears, we saw Guppy's paw on the, the loading screen for it. Hopefully it's a sign. the kills charger spacebar item, I believe. Yeah, we could have that. Can't afford anything else now, but that's okay. I was checking for the second secret room there, honestly, not the the first secret room, but whatever. Well, at least it's not a champion, but it's still a bad draw. Largely because he has a bit too much HP and also those super quick psychic shots that if you're close enough are guaranteed to hit you. those affected his max HP. Or do you have to kill them? Uh, just hit him then. Would have been dead by now if I'd kept hitting just him, I think. But even a range is bad. Please go away, spider thing. Thank you. It affects his HP right up until the point it turns into a spider. I'm pretty sure there is a champion where killing the spiders constantly drains his HP though. I don't think I've ever heard this part of the boss music. Oh, I better get an old set up for this. Oh, there we go, that's a cycle back around. That's range is one of the things I needed. Not the biggest priority though. Oh, Ty. We look fabulous. Thank you for feeding the hairball. Bomb, please. No, that's not a bomb. That is, though. And sad bombs is good. It's not a stat increase, sadly, but it's still good. Get five free bombs, and now they have our tier effects. So, two spirit hearts, please. Thank you. That puts us on track for the deal with the devil, although the boss fight is still going to be painful. One little damage up from the, the deal, though. And this is actually an okay run. Not a great run, just an okay one. But with promise because of a weird item setup. I like that I've just attached the clamps onto the cat hat. I 
Yeah, it's a well worth it. Secret room. Three pennies. With these three pennies, you're spoiling us. Done item room, not done shop, which is there, which we can open for free after this room is clear. It's worth looking in. The oh, hairball's getting pretty big, thanks to killing the dips. No greed. No greed. Hive mind. Um, hive mind blue candle. Well, we're not taking blue candle because I'm doing the the dad's key kind of thing. So we'll take hive mind and see if it pays off. I realised I asked people to say what they got for Christmas, those of you who open up presents early, and the only one I remember seeing was Zeppel saying he got a coffee maker. Because I was disgusted. <laughs> that was a good guess. Well, we don't need the key pieces because we already have the key. Painfully slow boss fight that will repay us with a good deal with the devil that will not be Krampus, because that would just be Crow. By all means, keep on touching the fire. I think the hairball got him a little bit there. Oh, I did there. I know I could have used a sad bomb to kill him, but it felt like a waste. You let me know when you open them, but it should be sitting though. Okay. No Krampus. Okay, no Krampus and a good item. I am fine with that. We got the item room. I am going to go look in the curse room because we're on our way towards becoming Guppy anyway. $30 you can buy Battlefront 2 with that. Yeah, or you could not and spend it on something worthwhile. That's just an option though. We're actually literally giving away Battlefront 2 for free with PS4 Pros because they're cheaper than buying the PS4 Pro by itself. You do have to have a, a Pro that has the Rebel and New Order logos on them, but that's a small price to pay for a deal. I'm tempted to buy another Spare Heart because we didn't get any stat improvements, but well no we technically did, we technically doubled our DPS. Wolfenstein 2 is already 50% off. Christ. That probably means it didn't do very well. You are meaning like the new Colossus or whatever it was called. Oh yes, if you haven't bought Hollow Knight, you can buy Hollow Knight. That's in the sale. It's a game. Think of it like you've got a slightly squiff double vision. Like 2020. If, if I'm standing still, that's what this effect is. It's just when I'm moving, Incubus is a little bit behind me. Succubus, whatever. So our shots are a little off. Unless we're standing still. Okay, no secret rooms there. Resident Evil 7 was good too, yeah? 
pretty I kind of missed out on. I didn't hear anything terribly bad about it. Okay, I found our boss super early. It's a 1 in 3 chance of a deal. I guess just go for it and see while I've got the HP. I was expecting the second secret room to be here. Yes, feed the hairball. Feed it. Feed the hairball, mewahe. Hmm, do we know anything about our pill rotation yet? I'm going to finish clearing the room first in case it's teleporting. Or a teleporter. Look up! Okay. This particular champion of Polycephalus I was willing to use a bomb because it's the kind that has not got a lot of red HP. Red HP, any HP. And sadly we didn't beat the odds. We did get a damage up though, so now we're above starting damage. Might as well check if it's greed. It is not. What is that item in the bottom right? Um, don't remember if I picked that up at all. Don't have enough for it either way. Yes, if I had 2020 on top of this, it would be like having quad shot. So if the game wanted to give me three books or just straight up 2020, I'd be okay with it. Nod leaf. Nope. And I think we're done on the floor, sadly. We improved our damage. Our speed is good, our range is good. It's just a shame we didn't roll well on the deal with the devil. I could have kept on looking for the secret room, I suppose. Well, we can definitely open up that boss trap room. Just to see what's in it. Too much HP. Bomb for a key, don't need that right now. He's shoving my tears away. Spirit heart. Okay, we'll open up the boss trap room and take a little look. <sighs> yeah. No. <laughs> I thought, what if it's Cricket's head? It was not Cricket's head. It was a chub that is spawning a lot of crap for some reason. He's not a champion, so I don't know why he's spawning as much as he is. Ugh, peep, actually. Oh, you're not allowed to walk out? J'accuse. Quite sure why I'm pushing him back as much as I am. Also, he spelt a letter A on the floor with his urine.
Okay, we're fine. Maybe this is the direction I want anyway. I opened up that door. For whatever reason, you can't open up a boss trap room door to get out. Secret rooms can't be there. Can't be here either. Hello, the Gurnator. I didn't see you come in if you did say hello earlier. I would love for the item room to have a tears up in it. Oh, we don't know. Ugh. It had nothing in it. This looks like prime secret room territory though. Yep. Two live bombs and a bomb. Maybe that's not going to lead to anything there, I think. Shop. No. Almost. Do we have enough for a half-price good item or maybe just a spirit heart to cover damage? Need our boss. Oh, not the situation again where they constantly regen. Kill the bastard. There we go. the curse that's going to double up all the runes except if they're Jarrah's he was blank rune okay we'll take the Jarrah Jarrah is not a reroll it is the doubling up of items because I've been getting those two confused recently Have I embarrassed Nurgle? How could I have embarrassed Nurgle? Sure I did. We locked out and got the Gurdy that only spawns things, so this is very easy. Bye, Red Ranger. Oh, we didn't get a deal again. That was a 72.5% chance. This run is going down the crapper because we're not getting deals when we should be. That sucks. Let's just hope that that one was the floor with Krampus on it, I guess. Oh, and we've missed out on another deal with the devil because this is a double floor. Nice. It's okay. I don't need stats or anything. You're supposed to be able to win this game on base damage and... But we're not quite base damage, we're slightly above base damage. 
slightly above base damage and slightly below starting tier rate. Which probably balance out to starting stats, honestly. This should hopefully... Uh, let's double them up. Let's go for broke, why not? I'm just kind of... Kind of going like that. Give me the good stuff. Okay, we got items. <laughs> And that will give us... F no, that's not the one that gives you flying. I'm getting confused with Fate. That's Fate's reward, which is a follower. <laughs> he shoots very small shots. I don't know if he does anything beyond that. Well, if our item rooms are garbage, what I'll probably do is just do a quick Azazel run. Because this is just a run that's dragging on. That's not the game I'm playing. Because we're not going to be getting given... Deals with the Devil. Oh, he was on the different wall. We got everything needed there, let's just move on. We're struggling to even kill the portals. Down there, don't I? Whoops. Hmm. Thank you, Lord Psychon, for the bits and for remembering hmm. hashtag charity. And I chat with hmm. gift emotes again. Oh, and oh. hashtag charity if that's working still. It is, and thank you. I think chat appreciate it. Appreciates it, rather. Even if the moats aren't forever. It's not so bad, I guess. Speed was a little high. No secret room still. But where I didn't finish that room is just... It was an annoying room. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to have to go back that way now, though. whatever comes near me, I guess. Sooner or later the bonies will die. Maybe not to me, maybe to Incubus, but they'll die. Yep. I'm surprised we didn't get a charge there, actually, from the kills, I mean. Unless Incubus kills don't count for me. Some of the Halloween ones are still usable, true. Oh, you're an invincible one. No wonder I wasn't making any progress. It can't possibly make this run worse. It made this run substantially worse. Tier rate went to 17. <sighs> but I got a luck up. Our luck actually balanced very highly there. Well. 
Run's got one more item room to impress me, and then we'll just switch those ears off. I just cannot find the secret room either. Item room, please. Hmm. No, but they'll die easy enough. I say, but I keep forgetting although our damage went up, our tier rate might as well have doubled, honestly. In terms of how slow it is. Did I check this room with the key? I did, didn't I? As in Dad's key. Oh, God damn it! where's the other item room? Yeah, it's great that we've got fantastic luck now, but we're getting nothing to do with it. Could be interesting. Nope, never mind, but whatever. We'll take it. We have gold keys, so we might as well. Into Mises. I guess I should kill them. They're exploding like Bob's brain when I kill them. Oh, I know, only that one did. Bob's brain is so far back in the follower queue as well, it's never going to hit anything that I'm aiming at. Oh, I see, it's getting the effect. What happened to Announcer Man? He sometimes just doesn't work. I don't know why, <laughs> he just doesn't. Because it's a very well programmed game, you see. Made by a quality company. All right, here's the other item room. Last chance, Ron. That is actually good, but I don't think it gives you, all right, give you a 0 0.41 damage up. So that lets you break open rocks and stuff with your tears. Uh, sack boy is good. But again, it's not a statistical increase. Of course, that didn't drop any money. Telepills or the hanged man? Telepills. It could be a deal with the devil, mind you. <laughs> Two of diamonds! Oh, I don't like you. Oh, I could play the blood bank some more, but it's kind of stretching it at this point. We do have two bosses to kill. Oh, that's a speed up and HP. We have too much luck for how bad this run is. We move fast, we just can't kill fast. It's 
I can't tell if I've done the rim or if there's still an enemy floating around. Ah, that's what I thought. <laughs> Well, I guess we can see we've got a 100% deal with the Devil Chance after Mom. We might get another stat increase from the first boss. Deal with the Devil? Deal with the Devil. Never mind. Let's check it now. Oh, you know how to tempt me. Wait, Death Touch actually makes your tier rate worse? I know for survivability's sake I really should be taking Satanic Bible, but I'm not gonna, because I'm okay for this run to end. The lovers. No, it has made my tier rate worse, but at the same time it's scythes, so now I have a reason to stick with it. Because I had cashed out. Oh god, I took Bob's brain though. Where are the bloody bosses? Oh, that's a nice effect. That was Bob's brain. Free battery. Yeah, I definitely should have taken static Bible. I would not be in danger of dying, that's for sure. Oh, of course it won't be here. Oh, I got a charge from the kill. So there's a secret room. It's not mom straight away. I'll play this four times, why not? That was our last shop. And then explode it. Oh yeah, so every single bomb I place is going to be size as well. We have quite a lot of bombs. Thanks, Bob's brain. Got the jobs done, though. Jobs... I accidentally said jobs done instead of job done. Because that quote from Warcraft is stuck in my head. Forever. I swear to God, if you're Krampus. Oh, wait, yeah, we'd already seen this. Well, I'm just going to telepills for the hell of it. And then I'm going to take the other telepills and I'm going to telepills for the hell of it. Just in case we got an eye of room for some more items. Work, work, stop poking me. Job's done. <laughs> Warcraft 3? No, it was earlier than that. I think the very first PC I got had a demo on it for Warcraft 1. Risky business. A telepill, she say. Sure, I am Aramie, bitch. Called the game a bitch and it didn't listen. My lessons from that pimp have proven useless. Well, there's some survivability right there. Two of clubs, so that doubles our bombs. Might as well, because I'm using quite a few of them since they look so fun. It's actually a run where Bob's brain is tolerable, despite the fact it's already hurt me and will again, because when it goes off, it sides. Like that, for instance. Wait, does that give you HP? I can't remember. Mm. It did not. Mm. Oh, hey, give me Liberty Cap, though. Mm. GG. Mm. Thank oh. you again, Lord Zycon. Something, something, blah, blah. You unlocked Christmas emotes for 12 other people. Work, work. You're dead. I was going to blow up the rest of the things, but I want the bombs for murderizing things. 
Sides had him killed as well. Joker? It is Joker. Well, I should probably wait and see if we just earn it first. Because if we do earn it, then... Chat, don't let me forget that's there. Because then I can get another deal with the devil on the Isaac floor. Oh, it was open anyway. I forgot we had spirit hearts. Uh, I can't be bothered. There's a key room up here, uh, which has a dice room inside of it, I mean. Oh, it isn't up here. It's on the other side of the L-shaped room, I guess. Would I re-roll this run? No, because it has sides. If it didn't have sides, then I would have. Assuming it's a re-roll. It might not be. If it's to do the floor over again, that's another chance to deal with the devil. Which I guess might have some merit. If we get another guppy item out of this one. Problem is, though, I don't remember how many spirit hearts I have. And it's not max. Thanks, Bob's Brain. Wheel of Fortune. Oh. I was just going to blow you up straight away, but I'll actually play you. I have 6.7 luck. Why are you not getting married? One thing. Fantastic. Two. With this much luck, that is a ridiculously low payout. Three rerolls. Either everything on the floor or in the room. Apart from enemies, it seems. Get out of my way. Okay, so there's Mom. Well, it lives, I mean. Devil card. Don't forget the Joker card. Don't forget the Joker card. You might be thinking about forgetting that Joker card that you've left somewhere else on the floor, but don't be doing that. Just had to hit me one more time, didn't you? Ah, crap. Oh, we know that's a good thing, because it'll give us one red heart, which we can then get rid of. We're not guppy, though, because we still need one more, but we might get that on the the bonus deal with the devil we're going to get. No. Oh. Quite a little procession. Now, where did I leave that card? Is it here? Um, is it? No, it's not here. Oh, no, the card got re-rolled, didn't it? The Joker card got rerolled, didn't it? Because the three rerolled everything on the floor. That was a nice guppy dream I had once. I did not think that through. Oh well. There's no guarantee that the bonus deal with the devil in the cathedral was going to have the final gap item. There was a chance, but it wasn't guaranteed. Whoops. <laughs> yeah, just take out my aggression on angels. Why isn't the music stopped? Okay. On the plus side, we are going down to the chest with a lot of luck and keys this time, unlike last time. Didn't I already pick you up this run? That was an interesting effect. Ooh, a dead end. It's a Christmas miracle. Peril font, which I could double with Jera, but obviously we're going to take Jera down to the Ooh. final floor. Thank you, bum friends. My last bits for hashtag charity. Thank you for choosing to use them. A guppy dream is not similar to a wet dream unless you're a furry. Is that a dime? That was a dime. I 
Oh, right, yeah, we have acid tears. I keep forgetting that. I would argue I was out of range of that, but whatever. Bombs are key. We had more than enough keys, and that means I can spam more bombs. Oh, your bloody orbiting fly touched me. Because I was like, you did not touch me. And he didn't. It was this fly. It exploded. Oh good, a steam sale at the last minute, again. Hey, I was going the right way. I'll be honest with you, I was planning on going down the way, but now we know where Isaac is. That saves me a dad's key use. Hey, Lokis. Turned one of them into mush there. Yeah, the bombs are doing more than my tears. Although that's largely DPS related. of steel. Red signs of death! It was worth it! Damn right it was. As I move in Newton, thank you for three months in a row. And thank you, Zappa Work. Same to you. Don't forget to use Jara. Uh, Chocolate milk again. Ooh. Well, I know we're gonna lose. Well, oh, also first of all, just open up that. We're gonna lose polarized invincibility, but whatever. Okay, big electric size. I am all about this. I didn't mean to change my form there. Also, I didn't pick up the mulligan. There we go. Pretty good. We might die on Mega Saiyan. I don't know how much health I have. But I am planning on doing a full clear and then doing Mega Saiyan. Because we have lightning sides. It's basically my dream run now. I, did, I should have Jared that. I'll do it next time. We might get a room for two chests drop though. Get judged. D12. Thank you, that is a big scythe I have here. <laughs> Pollux oil. You ain't seen nothing yet. <laughs> uh, that's the uh, yeah, one reroll type after another. Is this one? Did that do anything for me? Can't tell. Well, this was a sucky run to start with, but it certainly becomes something beautiful. I did give the seed for this one, right? I didn't. There it is, quickly, for you to pause it if you want to see it. Blood bombs? Nope. Oh! Oh wait, no, that's overwritten the size, though! Still kind of cool. Yeah, it's interesting. It's a shame it's un overwritten the size. That's the only thing. 
Wait, what's that gonna do to my bombs? Oh, damn, man, that's no use to me. Just a bomb in the next room. Okay, that's pretty cool too. Hey, I got rid of the curse. Hello again, Sagittarius. See, I keep on thinking that's Blood Bombs because Blood Bombs was an item in Anti-Birth that looks very similar to that. It's a good idea for an item, that. If you have no bombs, you can expend a heart to make a bomb. Probably want to throw out like an epilepsy warning. This is a lot of zapping. Especially when I use a bomb. For a throw. I could re-roll something back here, right? Because I left a couple of items. Somewhere. Fruitcake? That's a dangerous thing, so I'll take it. Random tier effects. What the hell happened while you were away? Nothing. What makes you think something happened? There's literally nothing amiss here at all. I'm fairly certain we're going to kick Mega Saiyan's ass. Didn't really want to take Balls of Steel, thank you. Actually, why do I even need Dad's key? I might as well take Mr. Boom. Abundance. Okay, well, hang on. I'll leave the algae there for a second. Oh, we didn't get a chest. Wait, something's still alive? Like one last try at a chest, please, so I could double it up. Oh. If delirium appears, do I go for delirium or do I fight Mega Saiyan? Well, don't need to say it because it never appeared. Black hearts do any, uh, damage to all enemies in the room when they are lost, yes. Stay sterile. We're getting those Kamehameha tears every so often thanks to Fruitcake. Hey, we're already on the angels. <laughs> Don't tell me what to do, Satan. Oh, hey, I, I have an algae's card. Forgot about that. Might as well make it a flawless victory. I didn't realize you get delirium off of Mega Saiyan. Never mind then, we're still going. <laughs> He's already dead, let him do an attack. Well, delirium will get an attack off, I'm sure. I'm not sure about anyone else, though. Guppy? No.
victory lap possible. I believe you can only do victory laps if you kill the lamb. Two Burkanos, sure. Oh, hello, the bloat. How's your sex life? You don't have one because you're already dead. Uh, don't know. Booger tears, okay. A second steam sail, wonderful. I don't know what exploded, but that's fine. Oh, it's probably occasional fire mind effect or something. Like, for instance, that's what happened there, I guess, because all the enemies were dead. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's fire mind, because that was fire mind right there. It's really only algae's I need. Oh god. <laughs> that made my eyes go funny, so again. Epilepsy warning, etc. Oh, never guppy. <laughs> never mind epilepsy warning, game crashing warning. Hello Delirium. You're the the most dead. You shall be the most murderized. I don't know where he is. <laughs> Wait, is he an angel? He was an angel. kamikaze me there. He appeared to have been a single hand there. Trying to avoid my own tears and Bob's brain. He is dead, though. That was quick. No, not a full clear. I can't take the risk with fire, mind. But hey, Mega Saiyan and Delirium in the same run. I didn't think that was possible, and now I know. Poor Isaac. Oh, he got for Christmas was a broken home. It's the implication that Isaac's mom killed Isaac's dad. No, the implication is that Isaac's father beat his mother. So she left him and took Isaac and then went nuts from the loneliness, presumably. Or that Isaac hid in the chest because of their domestic abuse and accidentally suffocated himself. And he goes delirious prior to that happening and then thus imagines the whole game. He possibly imagines his mother trying to kill him. The gist is, he suffocates himself by locking himself in the chest by accident. And on that happy note, Merry Christmas to people watching after the fact on YouTube. See you later. Ta-ta for now. <laughs>